The earlier a cancer is found, the more likely that the cancer can be treated successfully with surgery alone. For cancer of the esophagus, once the malignancy has invaded the deeper layers of the lining of the organ or nearby lymph nodes, then surgery combined with preoperative chemotherapy and radiation is recommended. In cases when the cancer has spread to other parts of the body, clinical trials of chemotherapy and radiation are the only hope. Various treatment options are thus available for esophageal cancer based on its stage. Surgery is the most common treatment of this cancer, especially when found early. The basic goal of surgery is to remove the tumor along with all or a portion of the esophagus, nearby lymph nodes, and other tissues in the area. The removal of the esophagus, known as an esophagectomy, then requires a new conduit to be fashioned to substitute for the esophagus. This new tube is usually constructed from the stomach, though the colon and small intestine can also be used. This surgery is performed through various techniques, and consultation with your surgeon is mandatory to find out which method is best for you. Chemotherapy uses anti-cancer drugs to kill cancer cells. Radiation therapy involves the use of high-energy rays to kill cancer cells. The combination of these modalities is often used as primary treatment in advanced disease or to shrink the tumor before surgery. When the cancer has spread and palliation is needed to allow a patient to swallow normally, then laser therapy and stent placement can be of use. Laser uses high-intensity light to locally destroy tumor cells and relieve the blockage from the cancer. Alternatively, when the cancer has grown and the lumen of the esophagus has become narrowed, a stent can be placed to relieve the obstruction and allow food to pass. As mentioned, these methods are only used to improve the quality of life and cannot cure the disease. Understanding esophageal cancer thus is the first step in your treatment process. With the help and support of your family and physicians, a successful outcome can hopefully be found. Mm.